show already in progress. Folks, my first guest tonight is a very funny stand-up comedian and a very funny elderly star of Oh Hello on Broadway. Please welcome John Mulaney. <laughs> Nice to see you. How nice are you? Nice to see you, Stephen. Haven't seen you in a long time. You were on here, uh, 2016 was the last time we were That's talking. What, I did the show then. I, I've seen you since then. I don't but you think... Did, you I did not see I've... me. Where were you? And that's a, are you that's a deeply creepy. I was in your bushes. That's what a is... deeply creepy way to start any kind of sentence. So I, you've seen me, but I haven't seen you. I've seen you. the back of your head. Have you? That doesn't make me feel any better. <laughs> and, and the back of your wife's head. Let okay, me be good. clear. Okay, okay, good. So now. Do it's... you recall the Met Gala at the Metropolitan Museum of Art? This oh yeah, yeah. The, the fundraising thing they do for the yeah for the costume wing. It's there, like yeah. it's prom. So we were in the line to so go. So you're into... in the line. You and your beautiful wife were in the line, and me and my beautiful wife were right behind you for about a half an hour, and I never said Why hello. Did you say hi? I choked. But I don't know anybody there. I would love somebody to talk but, to. But you know, I it was it became too late to say hello at a certain point. <laughs> Because I knew it was you, and I was like, it's Colbert. And my wife was like, say hi. And I was like, what if he's, what if he just turns and goes like, this is real life, you know? And... <laughs> so right now... What if you real life I'm totally me? bull you right now by saying right. that I like so you. Right. So friendly on air. Right. But when you're in the Egyptian wing of the Met, he turns on you. <laughs> no eye contact, No Mulaney. eye contact. Bob yeah. Dylan rules. <laughs> So, but I was nervous of the people in front of me because I was behind uh, uh, Claire Foy, who plays Elizabeth in The Crown, oh, and, wow. and uh, you were behind Felicity the Queen Jones, of England, yeah. Felicity Jones from uh, Rogue One. She was the two of them were in front of me, and I was. Did you say scared. hi to them? I said hi to I said hello to Claire Foy because she had been on the, the couch here. Oh, so, I had a so you do talk to people off the show? <laughs> Anytime you want. Anytime really? I, yeah, yeah. Okay. Do you want to go to the Met tomorrow? <laughs> I but I had just to. blown it, too. So I was also in a state, because uh, before we walked into this event, I said to my wife, who's the one person you want to meet? And she said, Kim Kardashian. I said, that's a great answer. We're in, we're in this long line, right? And I'm walking, and I see the artist Jeff Koontz. Okay? Sure, sure. And I go, hey, Anna, it's Jeff Koontz. And right then, Kim Kardashian is walking this way. I go, hey, Anna, it's Jeff Koontz. Oh, no! Like that. <laughs> Kim Kardashian gets spooked and keeps walking. And my wife doubles over laughing and is like, you blew it. Oh, she spooks easily. She's like a forest animal. You have yeah. to just, you have to get up like in a blind and let her come through, like at dawn. And, and, and oh no is never a good thing to yell at anyone, <laughs> even if you know them well. So she, she, she made, she got away and <laughs> she got away. That's sure. <laughs> that's, that's, <laughs> she uh, didn't fall into your snare. <laughs> It's just a, it's a serial killer. She got away, but <laughs> I won't be foiled again, Stephen. Uh, well, uh, please say hello next time. I will that'll say hello lot, next time that we're dressed in gowns in the Egyptian wing of the yes. Metropolitan Museum. The, um, uh, you are a busy man right now. You got so much going on. You got, uh, you got oh, a new listen. album out. You got a new tour. You, oh, hello on Broadway, which you invited me to come do a you little thing. You were a wonderful guest. We had a good time. That's going to be out on Netflix. That right? is going to come out on Netflix uh, Soon, in a couple days. A couple days. Okay. The album is out in a couple days. What I love about this is that, okay, so here you are. You're a comedian. You put out a comedy album. Why on vinyl? Uh, why on vinyl? Is it just warmer? Is it's, it what is I it? I actually haven't seen it before. Can I see it? Oh yeah, you, you literally haven't seen your own album? No, because they sent they it's like we have a bunch of copies for you, but my apartment's too small, so I sent them to my friend's place. Uh, <laughs> this is so great. There you are, wow. sorry. It's really beautiful. And I like it's kind vinyl. of the Mary it's... Tyler Moore thing on the front. Yeah, it's very we, we modeled it after jazz albums. Oh look, it's got a real record. Yeah, it's, it's a real record. <laughs> That's really cool. It's not <laughs> Yeah, it's not Beggar's Banquet inside. It's actually your album. It's, uh, I'm trying, we did the Broadway show. I'm trying to go backwards in terms of relevance. So, Broadway, vinyl, and then I'll do a puppet show at Ellis Island. <laughs> and then... For the immigrants. Yeah, for the immigrants. And they're like, uh, um, we might head back to the yeah, old country. This, uh, I think we're... Our eyes are not filled with wonder at your puppet show. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to release a dogger type eventually. And mm -hmm. that'll, be, that'll be the end of my career. A dogger type. A dogger type. <laughs> I didn't know it was pronounced that way. Uh, maybe it's not. Is it daguerreotype? I thought it was. Well, 
Edit that out too, please. <laughs> Why is there something else? Is there something else? Oh, for my monologue. Oh, the, oh, oh yeah. no, I meant. Yeah, great. That's just an expression. Yeah. Edit that out too, that's just please. An yeah, you know. That do you, it's a do showbiz you, talk. Do you use that term? Do you use showbiz talk with your wife? Because my wife and I like to say to each other, <laughs> if one of us is trying to cheer up the other one, uh huh, and we don't want to be cheered up, we'll go. That's not playing to this camera. <laughs> that is. Ultra specific. Yeah. That is ultra. Did your wife direct the Mike Douglas show or something? That is such Merv. ultra. Merv. Merv. Did you? Uh, so you just went to Japan, right? Yeah, my wife and I went to Japan. What is that like? I've never been. I've always wanted to go. You gotta was, go to Japan. Was this for business or was this just for pleasure? This was just for pleasure and to see Japan. Uh, my wife had been before, but I'd never been. Mm -hmm. I loved it. Mm -hmm. uh, I am not uh, a smooth. I, I, I would rather in life be. Uh, Polite than do anything. So, like, if you and I were walking through a doorway, I would go like this. And if you went like that, I would go like that. Sure. And if you went like that, that would go on for an hour. <laughs> and in Japan, uh, you know, and I don't want to speak in, in generalizations, but there is a, there's a sense of etiquette mm -hmm. that so jibes with me where, like, you would rather, like, just curl up into a ball <laughs> than ever offend anyone. And I'm, a very, I'm very bad at walking around the streets as a human being. Like anywhere or Japan? Anywhere, but I did well in Japan because it was just like, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. <laughs> oh, like you don't like, like the I, when I, of New York I embarrass here. my wife all day long walking around because I want everyone to like me. So I once said hello to balloons because <laughs> they were in my peripheral vision and I was like, look, better safe than sorry, hi, and then it was balloons. <laughs> and so we went to a Best Buy and I was with my wife, and the guy I said... still have those. Yeah, they, yeah. And the okay. guy said, do you have a Best Buy rewards card? And I said, no, I wish. And my wife said, oh, my God, and walked away, walked over to the printers and stood facing away from me. And then the guy said, do you want a Best Buy rewards card? Oh. And I said, no. <laughs> So did you, when you were over there, uh, did you have to explain what was going on in America uh, to them? Was this recently, since the they election? They have seen the news. Yeah, this was after the election. They, seen, they have the news over there. But they were trying to feel us out. They were like, so are you uh, happy with recent developments? <laughs> and and we it? were like, no, we're not, you know. Yeah. We're nice people. And <laughs> not that you're not nice if, you know. I'm going on a national tour. Not exactly. if you're not nice, yes, but... You just don't like nice people. We, yeah, yeah, we're fun yeah. and nice. We yeah. like David Bowie, and we don't understand taxes, so we're, we're liberal people, you know what I mean? Yeah, sure. So we explained that to them, mm -hmm. and uh, they said, are you sad? Are you scared? Are you sad? Are you scared? <laughs> I thought, no, we're not, like, sad. You know, I'm, like, kind of an optimistic person sure. about it all, so sure. I tried to explain that to them. Yeah. That, to me, it's like... Um, it's like there's a horse loose in a hospital. <laughs> like, like I, I, think, I think everything's gonna be okay, but I have no idea what's gonna happen next. <laughs> and like, none of you know either. Like, we've all never not known together. And on the news, they try to get people, they're like, we have a man here who once saw a bird in an airport. It's like, get the hell out of here. This is a horse <laughs> loose in a hospital. <laughs> and we're all like, it's not good. There are worse things. But there are worse things. Yes, but it's yes. confusing. Yes. Because every day we just have to follow the horse. And some days it's like, the horse used the elevator. <laughs> you're like, is the horse... You know those days where you're like, is the horse smart? <laughs> and then we're all just like, why hasn't the horse catcher caught the horse? And then the horse is like, I have fired the horse catcher. And you're like... <laughs> That shouldn't be a thing. Is this just called, I think, The Comeback Kid? The Comeback Kid, yeah. John Mulaney, the album is The Comeback Kid. Oh, Hello on Broadway comes out next Tuesday on Netflix. John Mulaney, everybody. We'll be right back with Richard Branson.